On today's episode, boy, these griefers didn't stand a chance. So today was a cargo day, yes sir. Your boy had 700 bands ready to sell, yes sir. Selling the cargo in Los Santos would've gave me 1.4. Oh yeah, we, we on that, we on that. I had my boy Peaceful help me, yes sir. They gave us three fat ass insurgents. And we're off. 1.4 million fucking dollars is on the line right now. This man steps out his bunker. I mean, he could have destroyed the shit, but he decided not to. He decides to hop on his funky ass oppressor and come towards us. Oh, if he's fucking. He was trying to blow up the cargo my homie was transporting, but he got packed up. As soon as our ghost ran out, he came straight for us. And a lot of these griefers like to make the argument, bro, Rockstar says to grief the cargo, which they do, but $2,000 and what, 50 RP? Is that important to you? Yeah, I bro. This man was trying his absolute hardest to kill both of us. I hit that boy with the upside down trick. Yeah, you're not catching me. Good luck. Good luck, nigga. The boy Peaceful was holding them off while I went to go get the last shipment. We're in the home stretch, folks. Surely nobody would, you know, try to blow my shit up, right? Yeah, definitely not. Definitely not. Hey, Damn. I'm not your baby. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> Dumbass, fuck out of here. Why they trying to hey. blow my shit up, bro? The boy oil came through and packed them up too. Yes, sir. Mission is fucking complete. Now let's go pack them up. As soon as his ghost Straight ran out, he ran into the crib. Shit, bro. That just showed me he loves to prey on people that don't know how to fight. Niggas like that, straight trash. Just like this bum ass barcode that tried to kill my homie for no reason. Watch out, light blues off radar. What the fuck is that? Watch out for that. Thing. Buddy was mad he couldn't grief our cargo, so now anytime he showed up, he was off radar. Bro, there's no way you hit me through this. This blue bum was on straight rat activity, bro. Bond you, bond you, bond you, bond you, you will, you will, you will. All right. Damn, I'm through this shit. Hey, he's across the car. Bro, you stupid. <laughs> oh, I don't appreciate you being there.
fuck you mean? I mean, like, bro. Bro, I'm about to go to the airport. Fuck this place. I don't have fucking time to be doing this shit. So that's what we did. We all went to airport. My boy Oil wanted to 1v1 the barcode, so he asked him. I texted him 1v1. You wouldn't believe what his response was. We went ahead and cleared the airport. This nigga just texted me no. Nigga. No. <laughs> what? You'd what do be you the mean first no? Emails. You'd be the first emails to challenge someone to 1v1 after somebody kill you. Bitch ass niggas, up the fucking shit. Keep in mind, this buffoon just said no, so my boy Oil started eating. This is what I like about you. The food that's advertised on the thing in like in america where like they'll advertise some shit and then they give you the food and it looks exactly <laughs> yeah here actually looks how the fuck is demonstrated this buffoon steps out the hangar and starts sniping at my homie bro was eating and got attacked mid munch that's crazy some bitch ass nigga just sniped at me and completely fucking missed bitch i'm standing dude. completely fucking still all you have to fucking do is put the crosshair on my fucking head about fucking time, you stupid piece of shit. I'm eating. Come on, you go. So while this dark green dude is tryharding on a nigga that's literally standing still and eating, the barcode made his way over here. You didn't want to fight him when he asked you for the 1v1, but now you see him fighting somebody. And you thought, nah, this is the time I should come to the airport. So while my homie's fighting dark green, I'm keeping the eye on orange. I'm not even looking at dark green. <laughs> you know, let me know. No, no, no. This is Dark Green's he's friend. Bad. He's in the he's glitch spot. And at this point, I'm tired. Look at this fucking bozo. Bring that ass here, boy. Bro. I didn't realize he went ghost to me, so I was sitting here sniping this man for a good two minutes. I started fully loaded and popped this stupid ass. But he couldn't handle that I had one more kill over him, so he left to reset score. There's no fucking way. Green and job to team. He's gonna try job to team inside. Dark green job TP's in here, right? Watch this shit. That boy is supposed to be cooked. Yup, that definitely 1000% makes sense. Yup. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, he was able to pull that off because he used, you guessed it, freeze lag. But AB, how do you know if somebody's using it? Don't worry, my boy. If the following things happen to you, you're probably dealing with a freeze lagger. Number one, if you blow yourself up while facing somebody or they kill you, and afterwards you still get shot, in the game. Oh. Oh. You are indeed facing a freeze lagger. That happens because even though you died and respawned down the block to the freeze lagger, you died and respawned huh? in the same fucking spot. Now, people are out there that are really like that and can damn near hit every shot. But there's a lot of people out there that use freeze lag and try to make it seem like they're actually good when they're not. Number two, let's just say you kill someone. And I mean, you smack the absolute dog shit out this person. But then, you know, they just casually get back up. Or you shoot them and it takes about five business days for them to die. Or they EWO after 10 years even though you put a bullet in their fucking cranium. Congratulations, you're facing a free wow. swagger. Yeah, the orange barcode ended up in the wall somehow. And due to the fact that I started fully loaded, there's absolutely nothing that I can do. So I left. I came back and with no surprise at all, this guy is back inside the glitch spot. So we got a person that loves to try hard on people with freeze lag while they're standing still and eating food. And a person that is married to the glitch box. Nope. They called in another person that was absolutely trash with the airplane. Bro went on 10 bombing runs and didn't come back with one kill. That's tough. Shit. I went ahead and made my way to the city. Yes, sir. Orange job TP behind us like he could actually do something. Come here, my good sir. Yes, sir. Fuck him up. Lucky, bro.
Damn, Damn bitch. I seen that shit. <laughs> Rank up. <laughs> Ranked up on his stupid ass. Oh, he's at the hangar. Hangar? Oh my god, bro. These niggas are so weak. And now Pink is over here trying to kill us again. I swear these motherfuckers was taking turns. Oh no, you got your ass beat? The fuck. Alright, bet. Alright, Pink, you're up next. Like, what the fuck? I went ahead and popped the ghost. Yes, sir. Job TP'd right behind Pink. Yes, sir. Ghost. Oh no, somebody. Uh, Dirty, nice. huh? Right, you are so pussy, nigga. Using TBS? TBS? That's a news station, my boy. I sent them a message. I'm like, oh, so using glitch spots was fine, right? Guess what this man responded with, bro? Absolutely oh fucking nothing. We went ahead and left the game, bro. I'll be damned if we fight these people for another hour. No. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed that shit. Make sure I hit that like and subscribe button. Turn on notification bell. Love him out a bit.